they have the two of wands and they have the five of cups so somebody is regretting something or they're regretting something that they waited to do this could be some type of decision that they're regretting the decision that they made you have the five of pentacles whatever decision that they made they feel like they've lost a lot life is hard for that person right now they're looking around for a help in hand but it's like they don't have anybody to turn to it's a lot on that person and they need, it's like they need help. You have the Six of Cups. And then you have the Ace of Pentacles. The Nine of Cups. And this could be you. This could be someone that you're attached to, someone that you have detached from. This could be someone who wants to come towards you, different people that they are attached to, different people that they have detached from. This is masculine and feminine energy, past, present, or near future. So you have to take what resonates and just leave what doesn't. You have the nine of wands. This is someone who wishes that they could reach out to you, but they're they're stuck, you know, dealing with some type of guilt. This could have been something that they did to you in the past. And they're regretting it. You have the King of Cups popping out in the reverse. This could be someone that was very cold to you. You have the Ace of Swords. And the Eight of Swords. Seven of Wands. So they're finding out the truth about somebody that was trying to create blockages for them. They wanted that person to be stuck or feel stuck. And this brought a bad, a lot of bad karma or bad luck with the Wheel of Fortune popping out in the reverse. Yeah, this has stressed this person out. Like they're going through a lot of anxiety with the Nine of Swords being here. And then you have the three of wands. Yeah, they're stressed out with the decisions that they made. And you have the devil. It's like whoever this person is that they were attached to, they felt bound to that person. This could have been some type of um, addiction. They shared the same toxic attachments with that person. Um, and they felt stuck to this person. But they didn't know that that person was trying to keep them stuck and blocked off from their will of fortune, which caused them to go through a lot of misfortune, bad luck. Keeping them stuck in the same situation, dealing with the same thing over and over again, just feeling trapped, being blinded from the truth, having doubts. And feeling like they could not control um, their thoughts. This had this person where they weren't able to manifest anything. So if they were trying to get money or gain money, have prosperity, they couldn't. Because the person that they were attached to wanted to keep them trapped. So they could not see clearly. They could not move how they wanted to move. Yeah, they felt powerless. But they're definitely, their wish fulfillment or their wishing that they could reach out to you, talk to you. Um, they could feel like you're very guarded because they were cold to you in the past. So that makes them a lot, a little nervous. And they're kind of like up in their head thinking about the decisions that they made. This is someone who operated out of their shadow self. Yeah, somebody lied to this person about something. And then after this lie, 
they started going through a lot of bad luck. Like they could have, you know, stayed attached to this person because they were believing that this person was going to gain a lot of abundance or they would build prosperity. They would be able to prosper with that person. But this was some type of trickery. This was some type of blockage. You have caution. This is someone who did not pay attention to something. And they could have been overworking their self in a situation. And didn't know they wouldn't be rewarded. They didn't look into this person before they got in a connection with this person or they got attached with this person. I mean, attached to this person. You have fire signs. So Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. So you could be a fire sign. Whoever this person is, they could be a fire sign. Yeah, they're finding out that someone lied to them with liar being here. They didn't realize they were dealing with someone that's very sneaky, very deceptive. This could have been a relationship. With divorce being here, somebody is, is experiencing some type of breakup. They were gambling. It's like they took a gamble with this person and they did not know it would um, create a lot of problems in their life. Their finances are not good right now. And they definitely were struggling with some type of addiction. You have date night and then pregnancy. And then you have water sign. So someone could be expecting, someone could be pregnant, you could be pregnant, you could be this water sign. Um, you could know someone that's pregnant or something like that. This could be someone that want, is ready to, wants to come towards you. This person wants to have a child with you. And they want to date you. Like there's some type of date here. This, this talks about getting ready to be um, wined and dined by another person. So this could be somebody that they dated. Or yeah, this is someone who wants to date you. They want to have a child with you. Um, and then you have moving here. This person wants to move in with you. They feel like whoever the person is that they moved on from, because move on is on the bottom of the deck was a waste of time. Yeah, this is someone who could have placed a love spell or they placed some type of love spell over this person and they weren't aware of this. Now, they could have moved this person into their home. This person could be someone that's pregnant or this person, this this there could have been some type of question about a pregnancy and they found out this person lied. They could have gave this person a lot of money or something like that, or they could have wined and dined this person. But this is someone who was definitely trying to come in between a connection that they want with you. And this all took place in the past. Now it's like they're moving on because they're realizing this person was a waste of time. Now it's like they want to move away. This is someone who wants to be in a connection with you, relationship with you. Um, and they want to have a child with you. This person wants to live with you. Yeah, you have challenges. This is someone who um, couldn't, they felt like they did not make the right decision in the past or they just could not make the right decision. And they ended up going through a lot of challenges. This is because they needed to do a lot of inner work, inner healing. 
in order to um, manifest a true commitment, something serious. Because somebody placed some type of illusion over this person. And they didn't know what they, who they were dealing with. You have missed opportunity. They feel like they did not act when they should have. In the past. You have responsibilities. Yeah, this is someone who needed to, um, who needed to, or need to take care of their, um, financial and emotional needs because no matter what they did if they were making bad decisions they were not satisfied and they immediately realized this after they um could have did something to you in the past like they could have just distanced themselves from you you haven't heard from this person they could have made you feel as if they left you out in the cold or they're just um, left you high and dry or something like that, left you hanging or something like that. Maybe this love spell was supposed to make this person leave you out in the cold. Yeah, they're afraid it's too late to take action or come towards you. It's been a long time since you heard from this person. This is someone who feel like they neglected you. That's why the five of pentacles is here and the six of cups. They feel like in the past they neglected the connection that they want to have with you now. And they feel like it's a missed opportunity. Yeah, neglected. And you have values. So this person could have valued material things. And this is why they're in the energy of having a hard time or they could have just lost a lot financially. Yeah, they were gambling, operating out of their shadow side. This person is realizing their flaws, the things that they did in the past that weren't, weren't good. You have damage. So they feel like they hurt you in the past and whatever they did to hurt you is hurting them now. You have the runner, yeah. This is someone who ran from this connection, but they don't want to run anymore. But they're question, questioning their self, is this a missed opportunity um, with you because they did not take action? They felt like a lot of time has passed. They've waited a long time and they're in regret for this waiting period. We have escape. And then you have men. So yeah. They've ran out of the connection that they were in with whoever this person is that placed this, you know, love spell over them. And now they're wanting to mend the connection that they have with you. This is someone who does not want to lose hope. They don't want you to lose hope. They don't want you to give up on the connection. Because their plan is to come back towards you, reach out to you, communicate with you or something like that.
We have isolation. So they could be just spending a lot of time by themselves. We have doesn't want to work. I found out you're my twin flame. So they've isolated themselves from whoever the person is that placed this illusion over them because they did not want to work. But they ended up finding out that you're their twin flame. So this is your twin. You have Aquarius. So whoever the person is that doesn't want to work, they could be an Aquarius. You could be an Aquarius. This person could be an Aquarius. Take it where it resonates. An Aquarius could be facing some type of jail time. Yeah, that popped out twice. You have black magic and they were trying to use children. So this person did something very deceptive. And whatever they did, they're facing jail time for this. Like if they were using black magic to try to keep this person stuck, um, using children, or they could have did something to another person's children using this magic, they're facing jail time for this. You have Scorpio. You could be a Scorpio. One of these people could be a Scorpio. And you have exposure. Yeah, they got exposed. This is someone who does not have anywhere to go. Then you have karmic friend. And then you have confidence. Aries. You could be an Aries. One of these people could be an Aries. They need to move on. So there could be a karmic friend and an ex that got exposed for something. These people were attached to whoever your twin is. You have hidden emotions. So whoever this karmic friend is, they knew that your twin felt some type of way or had emotions for you. And they were trying to make sure that that person stayed away from you with boundaries being here. You have cancer. You could be a cancer. One of these people could be a cancer. You've healed. So whatever it is that you've went through in the past, you've healed from this. Yeah, seeing things for what it is. Suffering in silence. Wow, bad karma. And then right path. So they needed to go through a lot in order to find out the truth. This could have been karma that they needed to clear out. Negative karma to get on the right path. They needed to set boundaries with whoever these people are. Because somebody was definitely off into magic. Now, whoever this karmic friend is, that person could have been using magic. And also whoever the person is that they were in some type of connection with. And they needed to like set boundaries with these two people. Yeah, these are people that try to block their blessings. You have you've changed. So they've watched you make a lot of changes. Even though they were distant from you, they've been watching you. Yeah. You have reevaluate. They only wanted to use you. Yeah, somebody is definitely doing a lot of self-reflecting. They're reevaluating everything and they're realizing that whoever the person is that placed this, this love spell over them, they only wanted to use them. This is someone who just did not want to work. And they felt like they could keep that person isolated away from you and they will control that person while they're unaware that they're using magic over them. Yeah, you have equal give and take, clarity, and then burdens. This is someone who is realizing what equal give and take truly is. They could have been confused in the past, and by them being confused, this, this weighed this person down. Kept them dealing with a lot of baggage.
And so they could feel like a karmic friend that does not have anywhere to go needs to move on. Now they could have hid their emotions for you because of this karmic friend as well. Yeah, you have high honor. And then you have official person. Sudden wealth. And then you have poverty. So this could be someone that they left out in the cold. That person felt like they would always be able to hold on to whoever your twin is. They wanted this person to respect them, hold them in high honor. Maybe they felt like they would be successful off of this person. And by them not knowing that these people were in this energy, you know, behind the scenes and trying to keep them blocked off. They went through a lot of hardship, financial loss. A lot of things that they just did not expect to go through because of what was hidden. The plans that these people had to stay attached to them and keep them on the wrong path. You have thoughts. And then you have despair. Now, if... This person knew that whoever this karmic friend is, if they knew that your twin was hiding emotions for you, they thought once this person disconnected from you, you would be in despair. You would be disappointed. With house popping out in the reverse, your stability would, um, you wouldn't be, you would have in, instability or something like that. You wouldn't be stable. Maybe they wanted your world to turn upside down or something like that. This is sad. Main female. Main male and main female. So yeah, both of these people were false people. These were karmic energies that they were attached to. This could have been a karmic soulmate and a karmic friend. Now it's like they're shocked. Or this could be people that are finding out the truth or seeing something for what it is. They're shocked. If they found out the truth about whoever these two people are, this karmic friend, this karmic soulmate, they're in disbelief. This could be people that supported these people, supported the connection that they were in with this karmic soulmate. Yeah, then you have distant horizons. They're shocked that they're no longer attached to whoever these people are. You have toil and labor. And then you have judication. And then thief. Yeah, these are people that work very hard to um, cause some type of deception in a legal situation. This could be a legal situation that this person was in. Or they could have worked hard to have another person dealing with a legal situation. They wanted to turn that person's world upside down. And they figured that person would make sure they stay distant from whoever you are if they were trying to do this to you. They can't believe the outcome. Whatever they were thinking they were, you know, going to do, if this is your twin and they felt like you would be left out in the cold, from um, some type of sudden wealth that this person would receive because they knew about this person being a twin or being on the twin flame journey. They're disappointed because whatever they were thinking, it did not work. Whatever you try to manifest for another person or think that you're going to do in their life, you end up manifesting that for your life. They didn't realize this. They ended up manifesting this for this person life and it helped them realize they made a lot of bad decisions. 